Alright, hello and welcome back to Genuine Tutorial. We are now in uh, the number 9. Okay, example number 9 of first principal derivative. Okay, in number 9 we have... Where is that? Okay, we have... Y is equal to 3 all over by the square root of 2x plus 1. Again. Again, we have Y is equal to 3 all over by the square root of 2x plus 1. Okay. That is our equation. Okay, again for the example number 1 to 8, uh, I will put the links on our description box or in the description box of uh, this video. Okay. Okay, let's start with the step number 1. In step number 1, let y is equal to y plus delta y and x is equal to x plus delta x. So the y will become y plus delta y is equal to 3 all over by the square root of 2 multiplied by x plus delta x okay plus 1 x is to transpose the y to the other side so delta y is equal to 3 all over by the square root of okay 2 multiplied by x plus delta x plus 1 okay minus y where y is equal to 3 all over by the square root of okay 2 x plus 1 Okay, the next step is to divide both sides by delta x. So, divide this by delta x, okay, also in this part or in this term, so delta x. Okay, to simplify this one, we have the delta y over delta x is equal to, in the numerator, gagamit tayo ng butterfly method, okay, to add or subtract the numerator. So, the outcome is 3 square root of, okay, numerator and denominator, 2x plus 1. Minus 3 square root of okay, 2 x plus delta x plus 1 all over by okay the square root I mean uh, the uh, delta x square root of 2 x plus delta x plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2 x plus 1 I think uh, familiar na kayo kung paano natin ginawa yan so ang next step is to rationalize the equation so to rationalize this Mag-multiply lang tayo ng 3 square root of 2x plus 1 plus okay, 3 square root of 2x plus delta x plus 1 all over by the numerator. Okay, kung ano numerator natin, we should uh, set that also sa denominator. So, gagayay lang natin. Since the numerator, like for example, x divided by x is equal to 1. So, that's the idea. So, 3 square root of 2x plus 1 plus 3 square root of 2 x plus delta x plus 1 okay so the outcome is delta y over delta x is equal to okay 3 3 square root of 2 x plus 1 raised to 2 minus 3 square root of 2 x plus delta x plus 1 raised to plus 1, I mean plus 1 raised to 2, all over by the denominator. So, so ano na lang yan, no? uh, distribution or copy na lang natin. So, delta x square root of 2x plus delta x plus 1, multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1, okay, times the numerator or the denominator of this uh, part. So, 3 square root of 2x plus 1 plus 3 square root of, okay, 2 x plus delta x plus 1 Ayan. okay the next step is to square each term okay so delta y over delta x is equal to okay 9 2 x plus 1 minus 9 multiply by 2 x plus delta x plus 1 okay all over by delta x square root of okay copy the denominator Okay. Okay. 
so the delta y over delta x is equal to okay 9 multiplied by 2 is 18 18x plus 9 okay minus 9 multiplied by 2x plus 2 delta x plus 1 all over by the denominator copy lang yan ulit so delta y over delta x is equal to 18x plus 9 minus 18x minus 2 delta x times 9 is 18 also okay plus or minus 9 all over by the denominator so delta x square root of 2x plus delta x plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1 multiply by 3 okay square root of 2x plus 1 plus the square root of 2x plus delta x plus 1 okay cancel out the 18x cancel out also the 9 positive 9 minus 9 0 and also cancel out the delta x Okay, since ang natira dito sa numerator natin is negative 18 delta x, so may delta x tayo, it means pwede natin i-cancel yan. Okay, so the delta y over delta x is equal to 18, negative 18 divided by 3, okay, is equal to 6. All over by, okay, the square root of, I mean, ha, negative, so negative 6. All over by the square root of 2, x plus delta x plus 1, multiply by the square root of, 2x plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1 plus the square root of 2x plus delta x plus 1. Okay, the last and final step is to find the limit. Okay, so to find the limit, gagamit na tayo ng definition 2.1 or the, the f prime of x is equal to the limit of delta y over delta x as delta x approaches to zero so the f prime of x is equal to the limit of negative 6 all over by the square root of 2x plus delta x plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1 plus okay the square root of 2x plus delta x okay plus 1 as delta x approaches 0. So the f prime of x is equal to negative 6 all over by the square root of 2x plus 0 plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1 multiply by the square root of 2x plus 1 plus the square root of 2x plus 0 okay plus 1. So the f prime of x is equal to negative 6 all over by, okay, the square root of 2x plus 1 times the square root of 2x plus 1 is equal to 2x plus 1 multiplied by 2 square root of 2x plus 1. So that is equal to negative 6 or negative 6 divided by 2 is negative 3 all over by, okay, uh, 2x plus 1 raised to 1 over 2 plus 1 is 3 over 2. So this is the final answer. Okay, if you want to recheck this, gagamit lang tayo ng basic uh, formula. So y is equal to 3 all over by the square root of 2x plus 1. Okay, yung gagamitin natin formula rito is d, d9. Okay, so y prime is equal to negative 3 all over by the square root of Okay, square root of 2x plus 1 multiply by 2x plus 1 which is equal to negative 3 all over by 2x plus 1 raised to 1 over 2 plus 1. So that is equal to y prime is equal to negative 3 all over by 2x plus 1, one over, raised to 1 over 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 over 2. So same sila sa final answer natin in the first principle derivative. So this is the end of the solution of number 9 and I hope you learned something about it.
and don't forget to click the like hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell for you to be notified in our next video uploads okay goodbye